It sure feels like it might rain today. I don't want it to. I want it to stay sunny and bright and clear. It feels so gorgeous out right now, but it might rain. So if it might, and it brings me peace of mind, I'm gonna have one of these, all right? I'm gonna have that ready. Do you do that with your team? Do you have conversations about what might be, what might be coming? and help them grow or watch them go. Julie and Bev's book that we've been studying uh, these past few weeks, it's talking about foresight and thinking ahead and thinking about what might be impacting not only the company, not only the organization that you belong to, but your own career as well. And having conversations along the way, adding foresight to your conversations, they talk about ESP, so ever scanning and pondering. Do you allow your team to do that? you allow the space to do that in one of the uh, recent polls that I put up uh, it was it was fascinating we we're talking about how frequently would you like to have 15 minute little micro 15 minute conversations about your career development with your manager and 99% said so we had some options right yearly annually maybe that's that's what you do the performance review uh, monthly quarterly weekly daily what would that be like and 99% said at a minimum quarterly. So that's four times a year. So in those moments, if you're thinking and you're struggling, great questions again, great questions to be found in here. But if you're struggling with how can I do that? How can I start building stronger relationships with my teams and understanding what their goals are and what their aspirations are? And then even using foresight, am I looping them in on challenges or opportunities that might be happening with our company with the industry in the market. If I'm just looking around thinking that it might rain, I, I can tell myself all day that, no, I want it sunny, it's gonna be sunny, it's gonna be sunny, it's gonna be sunny. And yet subconsciously I'm thinking it might rain. It gives me peace of mind to know that I'm doing something to prepare for it with that umbrella. So day to day, thinking about how we can incorporate these micro moments using foresight, thinking about what could be looping people in on what is happening and potential challenges and opportunities, again, that could be coming our way can help your team not only understand how they can make an impact within their company and within their role that they serve the company in, but also within their career as a whole and having that umbrella of opportunities and options ahead of them so that they know what they can be working towards. I'd encourage you to include foresight in your conversation. I'd encourage you to reach out and get this book. It's really cool seeing a lot of people who have picked it up already. Reach out if I can help in any way. If you're perfect, raise your hand. I'm not either. So why not grow? Be well.